Hello everyone, this is Running On Empty Food Review. Well, it's groundbreaking. It is game-changing, as someone actually said. KFC is flapping back into the fast food metaphorical arena with their Kentucky Fried Wings. And people are talking about this. And honestly, this is a release that I'm actually pretty excited for. KFC, I don't know if you remember this, but a couple years ago anyway, they used to have hot wings. They used to have, I mean, it's literally the same thing as buffalo wings. They used to have those, and then they kind of got rid of them, and then some places teased that it would be back, and then it never really came back. And people, you know, they've been feeling the impact of the loss of their hot wings. And a lot of people have been actually going through Kentucky Fried Hot Wing Withdrawal. So they blindsided us here. They came back and they said, you know what? For all of you quirky football fans out there, that's what they said they're bringing it back for, but anyone who isn't a football fan is still allowed to eat these. So, so you know, understand that. But especially for the football fans, they said, we're bringing these back. We're actually, you know, they're bringing back wings, but this is a new type of, of wing. They said these are crispier, they're tastier, and they're better than ever. And they're called the Kentucky Fried Wings. Now, they're, they're the chicken wings. That's that's exactly what it comes down to. Uh, you know, no frills otherwise. It's not like they're, you know, little uh, chicken wings that are on a little skewer and in a little merry-go-round or something. You know, it's, it's nothing crazy. It's just they're chicken wings, right? And they're back, though. They're available at every KFC. And there's different flavors of them. I'm going to try all of them out. There is an emphasis on spiciness here. Two of these three flavors that they're promoting are spicy. I want to see how hot they are, and I want to see how good they are. We'll try them all out. So they come in three flavors. They come in Buffalo, Nashville Hot, and Honey Barbecue. So again, two of those three are going to be spicy. You know, the Buffalo, Nashville Hot. The Nashville Hot is supposed to be the spiciest one, then followed by the Buffalo and then, of course, by the Honey Barbecue. And uh, price-wise, be $5 for six wings and $10 for 12 wings. So that's the, uh, that's the deal going on there. Now, for the sake of this review, I was able to get a little bit of a, a special setup here where I have three containers, two of each flavor. So I have two Buffalo, I have two uh, Nashville Hot, I have two Honey Barbecue wings, uh, but again, normally, you'll just get six of each one. But I was able to split it up for the sake of the review. And again, $5 for six wings is the asking price from right there. So that's what it comes down to. So you can root around through the pocket change and uh, flap on over to KFC to get your hands on these Kentucky Fried Wings. All right, here's the plan. We'll start out with the buffalo. Try it out. Let you know what it tastes like. Then we'll move over to the Nashville Hot and then over to the Honey Barbecue. Opening it up, I think the buffalo flavor is the one that they're really gonna be promoting the most. That's what I see in all the ads. That's what I see them really, you know, peddling, so to speak. Um, so I think you'll be seeing a lot of these. There I am with two of them in the Kentucky Fried Wing Bowl right there. And uh, there we go, there's the two of them. They're decent sized, and they're, they're sauced up. Let's grab one right there. Yeah, it is a saucy wing. And that's a little bit, looks like a little bit of a crispy coating. So with that, this is just their buffalo one. I'll see how spicy it is, and we'll see how it is. With that, the buffalo Kentucky Fried Wings going in. I'm gonna eat it over this now. Really what I wanted to do is just try out the wing, because I think 
once we nail down the taste and the quality of the wing itself, the other two, it's mostly just going to be, is it that same consistent quality? And then it's just about the different sauces. Yeah. I gotta say, honestly, compared to their uh, hot wings that I've had in the past, it's pretty good. Uh, I gotta give them credit. There we go. This is where the cap is. Yeah. I gotta give them credit for it. It's pretty good. It's flavorful, and it's spicy, but it's not... The buffalo is not overwhelming. You know, I always like to describe it more so, perhaps, as like a flavorful spiciness. It's got that spice. It's got that spicy kick. It's not gonna just drive you insane, though, right? You're not gonna be bursting into tears because of the, the spiciness or anything like that. It's like a flavorful spiciness. Uh, it's definitely there, though. I feel it, but it's good. It tastes good. Um, definitely coated in the sauce there. And what I like about the wings is that they have a good balance where it has that... It, it does have that little bit of a crunchy, breaded coating. You know, it is a little crispy on the outside, but it's still soft and tender on the inside, as you can see. Which is a good balance. I don't like the wings that are just soggy and, you know... It has that nice, firm, crisp to it when you bite in. That little crunch. But then the meat itself is tender, juicy... And honestly, I mean, there was a time where KFC was very, very beleaguered by, by me. I was just bashing them one time after the next, after the next, because I was really disappointed in their product. Um, but honestly, they've, they've turned it around lately. And uh, I'm impressed with the wings. Good quality, especially from KFC. I'm actually, I'm impressed. I think they're actually pretty good wings, especially for fast food. And uh, yeah, the buffalo sauce is good. Uh, again, don't expect it to be like, a scorching heat, but it's noticeable. So out of 10, I would give the buffalo wings, uh, I would give it 7.1 out of 10. You know, again, it's fast food, you gotta remember that, but for what it is, I think it's a little bit above average there. All right, now that we know what the chicken itself tastes like, we'll just move on and really just examine the sauces. This is their Nashville Hot. Right there, the oil-based sauce, the same as their Nashville hot chicken, so be very wary. I'm making sure I don't dump this all over my suit. Let's see, the, there's the wings. Nashville hot. So with that, try this out. I'll let you know how the sauce is. That's what it looks like. Right there. There. All right, I'll try out the Nashville hot sauce. You know, for how they market the Nashville hot as being spicier than the buffalo, to tell you the truth, I like the buffalo better. <clears throat> it has this lingering spiciness, the Nashville hot, but I don't think it's just, it's not, you know, I wouldn't say on a whole nother level compared to the buffalo wings. That spice is still there. You're still going to notice it. But to be honest, it's not as flavorful as the buffalo wings are. Like, with the buffalo, it's this creamy, flavorful sauce. It's it's there. You can taste it. This, it's like, all right, I can taste the spiciness, but it's just more oily. It's not, it, it's just not as flavorful. Quality of the chicken is the same, so I'm not going to go on to that. But honestly, it packs a little bit of a kick, but it just doesn't pack this punch of flavor uh, like the buffalo wings have. So honestly... I would, I would skip past the, uh, the Nashville Hot if I were here. I know they really push that, but the Buffalo Wings are better. Out of 10, the Nashville Hot. I, I would just give a, a 4.9 out of 10. Slightly below average. I was just expecting a little more flavor out of them. So, uh, also just more messy, more runny sauce. And then finally, to wrap things up, we've got the Honey Barbecue Wings right there. 
I would imagine the other side of them is more saucy. Yeah, there we go. Right there. There I am with it. And uh, again, self-explanatory. We'll see how this sauce is. Mm -hmm. I could definitely taste that sweetness there, too. Definitely very sweet. Very sweet. And provided that there's sauce on them, uh, you'll definitely be able to taste that, too. It's, it's definitely a lot more flavorful than the Nashville hot wings. Yeah, taste the barbecue sauce, but really it's that it's that sweetness in there that makes it, you know? Because they, they label it as being honey barbecue, and uh, thankfully that sweetness that you expect is there, and uh, definitely takes center stage. So out of 10, again, quality of the chicken is the same. I'll be rating the honey barbecue wings. I would be, I would be giving those, I'd probably give them about a 7.1 out of 10 too. I would say... The buffalo and the honey barbecue are probably tied. They're about equally good, uh, whereas the Nashville hot is lacking. So they're, they're spicy. Definitely there's that spiciness. Not in the honey barbecue, of course, um, but in the other two. You know, I would, I would say out of the three, my favorite has to be the buffalo wings. I always like the buffalo wings in general. I think they did a good job with those. Um, but I am a little let down and, and disappointed in the Nashville hot chicken wings. But overall, for KFC, I think they did a pretty good job with it. I like the quality of the chicken, and uh, again, I would I would suggest choosing between the buffalo sauce, if you want that little bit of a flavorful kick and spiciness, and uh, otherwise, if you just want something a little more toned down, then get the honey barbecue. So uh, that's all that it comes down to. Interesting concept, interesting design, and uh, I think they did a pretty good job with it, again, aside from just that one issue with the sauce. On a final note, keep in mind, that, uh, you know, if you want to support this channel, you want to support the radio show, consider doing it, patreon.com slash the report of the week. I also have my music show archived there for anyone to listen to if you support. So consider that a little bit of an incentive there, and you can listen anytime you want. Thank you, and take care. I'm your host, the report of the week.